G'day guys, what's crackin'? It's Ralph here, and I have some cleaning inventions to show you that have been sent to me by Nightcore. Now they didn't, I don't even think they said, hey look, do you want them? They just sent them along. And I'm like, these are so cool, I've got to share them with you. And there's a variety of different um, inventions here, but I just felt you needed to know about them, because I've not kind of seen a lot of this before. So the first is this, it's called a stick it wrapper. And I'm like, what is a stick it wrapper? So I start to open it and it's, it sticks together. Like, let's listen to this. And it's just a yellow sheet. What do you do with a yellow sheet you ask? Well, I'm glad you asked because I have a solution as I have a camera and watch this. It's gonna be a magic trick. No, I'm tricky. It's not. Sorry. So, let's put this down like this. And then you wrap your camera in it, right? And it wraps over the camera. And it sticks together. You know those times when you're like, I just want to carry my camera and I want to put it in my car or I want to stick it in a backpack or I want to put another lens on top of my camera in my camera bag but I don't want them clunking together or I've got something special like I've got a form of gimbal or a form of equipment that I need to be protected from this other piece of equipment but for space size I need to put them together. This brilliant invention enables you to put them together and it sticks, it sticks, it sticks. Oh, so good. Now, this is approximately this big. So, big enough to cover my head. Work that out what you like. It's like a large napkin. And so good. I would encourage you to... Oh, man. If I'd have known this was a thing before they sent it to me, I would have bought one already. In fact, I'd probably buy a couple. So good. All right, let's move on. What about these? Dust-free cotton swabs. So you open this little pack and inside you have, oh, 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7. Seems a bit peculiar, doesn't it? Maybe there's eight in there. There's 36 of these little cotton swabs individually. And what you do is they're dust-free. So you, you peel off gently and then you push you push one out? I've not used these before. I know what they are. Oh, yep. Oh. Oh, I've got two out. Now that's not dust free, is it? Cool. So they've got two ends, like a blow dart. They're quite tough. And don't do this, but I just need to, for your sake. Oh, it's like a, it's like a really hard, compressed, sharp cotton bud. There's a plastic thing in the middle. Both ends are both thin. This um, doesn't have any dust on it anymore because I put it in my mouth. So let's use this and here's the beauty of it. You know in your camera you have all these nooks and crevices. So you see like I can actually get into my hot shoe, which I don't put on because I'm forever sticking stuff on the top of my hot shoe. And I can clean it. And I can clean along the edges I can clean in the nooks and crannies. Oh, it's dirty. It's dirty. It's what you want, isn't it? And so, you know, when you go out and you have dirt and junk and crap all over your camera, you can actually use this to clean that out of the way. And because it's pointy, you can get into that. I should use the baby blower and blow that away. Baby blower down below link at the end of the video about what that does and how that works. Anyway, well done, Nightcore. So you can actually use this to clean all the hard to reach places of your camera. So good, so good. And what I, I'm not sure why they've put like six or seven, maybe they think it takes six or seven to clean your camera in a pack at once. Cause as soon as you open it, you break the air seal. They're all vacuum sealed. So I'm obviously, I'm not gonna open all them and I'll keep the rest of them for another time. But you could easily stick one of these in your camera bag and have it ready to go. If you knew you were doing, um, like I do a lot of shooting down the beach or uh, in near waterfalls or across landscapes uh, where there's water and there's sand and having these ready to go. And if you're with mates, you can just like, yeah, just clean it up with this if you need to. Cause sometimes I'm um, very, very handy. Anti-fog wipes. 
These are highly volatile. <sighs> Bless you guys at Nightcore sending me something that's highly volatile. That is just that is just an invitation to get some fun stuff happening with a video, isn't it? Highly volatile. These are anti-static formula, highly volatile, ideal for eliminating the fog on the lens, glass, or goggles. So what you do, what I would use these for, is sometimes when you do an astro shoot, and you go out at night, and what happens is dew and fog and all sorts of condensation builds up in your lens, but you don't know it. And so you'll be at a long exposure, and then you check, and you realize it's covered in water, and you're like, Oh, the whole thing's foggy and it's all stuffed. But you use one of these beforehand, which is like an alcoholic wipe, uh, except it's got a different formula. It says contains isotropy alcohol. Keep away from heat or fire. Not for use on contact lenses. <laughs> so if, you, if you've got a contact lens in and it's a bit moist, don't stick one of these in it. I hope you've worked that out already. Oh, so good, anti-fog. So that's what I would use on the thing. Lasts for 24 hours, gives you 24 hours. Now, let's go to cleaning wipes. These are from Nightcore. They're alcohol-free. Mild formula, highly volatile, ideal for cleaning cameras, lenses, glasses, and goggles. So you can use this on your lens. You can clean your screen, you can clean other elements of your camera, um, you can clean your lens, I don't know about you, but sometimes my lens grip gets a bit dirty and a bit gross, and instead of it staying gross, you want it to look nice and feel nice, I would use this. You can use the wipes on the contacts here, on your camera, and on your lens. Do not go anywhere near the sensor. Be very, very careful. But if there's a particular bit of dirt or you think, oh, it's a bit grimy or whatever, I want it better seal because you don't want the light getting in there, otherwise you're stuffed. I would use the wipe. So keep it away from the sensor, but you can clean the screen on the back. What do you think? What do you think about these cool little inventions? If you are digging them and you think they're creative, tell me down below in the comments what you'd use. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. Please subscribe. Thumbs up. I love doing this journey with you. I love hanging out with you. And I'm really appreciative of all the comments and the conversations and friendships we're able to grow as a result. And I've got a flashing 20 seconds left of video time on my camera. So I am out.